hello everyone and welcome to my youtube channel my name is lillian welcome if you're new and thank you for clicking on this video so today i'm going to be doing a little bit uh, i'm going to be doing things a little bit different and i'm not going to be having a house show but instead i'm going to be sharing a passion of mine i love diyn i love doing things myself and um, this is something that I had done a few months ago and I was waiting for a final product to show you the end result but unfortunately that hasn't happened yet but the project is still undergoing so once we are done to the very end I will show you the results so I'm making a cement sink and I'm only using cement and water and uh, as i do so let me just share the word of god for today and it comes from the book of uh, jeremiah chapter 18. so while i was um, looking at this video because i did it a couple of months ago and i shelved it when i bumped into it again and i thought of sharing it um it brought to mind the story of jeremiah and uh, god sent him at a potter's house so let me read the, the story for you. This is in Jeremiah chapter 18, verse 1. I'll go up to uh, verse 10. This is the word that came to Jeremiah from the Lord. Go down to the potter's house, and there I will give you my message. So I went down to the potter's house, and I saw him working on the wheel. But the pot he was shipping from, from the clay was mud in his hands. So the potter formed it into another pot, shaping it as, seemed, as it seemed best to him. Then the word of the Lord came to me, O house of Israel, can I not do with you as this potter does, declares the Lord. Like clay in the hand of the potter, so are you in my hand, O house of Israel. If it, if at any time I, I, I announce that a nation or kingdom is to be uprooted, turned down or destroyed, and if that nation I want repents of its evil, then I will relent and not inflict on it the disaster I had planned. And if at another time I announce that a nation or a kingdom is a is to be built up and planted and if it does evil in my sight and does not obey then i will reconsider the good i had intended to do for it wow that's the word of the lord for today and i want us to ponder on uh, a god that builds us and as he builds us sometimes things don't turn out as we hoped for or as we expected and if 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 they don't we we keep going because we know the potter is at work and at times we might find cracks in our lives cracks of misfortunes cracks crack, cracks of wrong decisions cracks of wrong turns that make us look mad like the potter was was, was, was uh, experiencing with his pot and if it does not happen as we expected it what are we expected to do my i would say we expected to trust in the potter that if it does not come out as as we hope for we can always be made again and become that which God created us to be. In this life, there are ups and downs. There are things that we, you know, uh, do or uh, decisions that we make that end up ruining or destroying our lives. But that does not mean it's the end. Those are just mad situations that eventually we turn out for our good if we are patient enough. 
as I was making these sinks, to be honest with you, I wasn't sure how it's gonna come out, and it turned out to be amazing. You know, this the first clip is about uh, the, the the process of how I made it, but this one that I'm I'm doing right now is. <clears throat> sorry it's something that i is 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 one of them that i had done before and i wanted to show you how it would turn out after it dries and it used to dry like after two days and then i would uh undo it and 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 this this is how it used to be it, it's not quite dry but it is it is workable you can work around it before it dries completely so i i don't know maybe i should let you watch through it it was an interesting one to be honest with you i just watched a, a, a video on, on youtube and decided to try it it's for a project that's that's in in progress and i will update you on that but it was exciting for me to see something that i had watched come out really good but to be honest with you, some of them didn't come out as good. And I knew what my mistake was. So when I show you the final results of how they turn out and how they were installed and how they look like, I will update you as well on the, on the um, mistakes that I made that made them come out wrong or come out mad. <laughs> as I quote the Bible. Thank you again for clicking on this video. I'll let you now watch um, the rest of it and enjoy a bit of music. I'll be right back. So once I was done with this process, I would put it in water to cure it, to make it harder, to make it um, more more solid. When you put it in water, it becomes more solid. And then I removed it after two days from the water and then I let it dry. I wouldn't let it dry for too long, maybe a day or so. I'll show you how it turns out. And this is how they look like after they are dry. When I pick them from the water and then I left I leave them to dry, to sun dry. This is the product that comes out after you see like the the, the hole in the middle um like this one is not you know 100 percent good but it's okay it will still work so some of the mistakes i made in the beginning i rectified them later on in as i continued so after they had dried i applied a coat of um, polyurethane to make it waterproof and then for some of them i decided to paint just to see how it turns out and for the painted one they, they really turned out good and after the, the the paint i only did one coat and then another coat of polyurethane that's waterproof again i did enjoy this project um, it it really surprised me and I would do it again thank you again for watching this video until next time God bless you 
if you want to see the end result of these um, projects do remember to subscribe hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified of any upcoming videos so if you haven't subscribed remember to subscribe also like this video give it a thumbs up and leave a comment please do leave me a comment let me let me hear what you think of this project and thank you again